how to st- it's, a, it's a similar question it's actually a similar question but now we're going to get into the nitty-gritty how to stay confident throughout regard throughout the match regardless of slumps or bad losses how to how to be able to be confident always it's 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 very similar it's a very similar answer to the last question because it's it's you're trying to plan the future you're trying to say but how can i stay confident through all of that and it's like you don't know what's going to happen if i could snap my fingers and you could truly understand what it means to be confident and that what confidence is is your capacity and willingness to show up to this moment just as you are and in, and and lean into it you don't understand that as you make that decision you change the trajectory of your future and you're not going to struggle with the same things that you may have struggled with in the past so you might look into your past and you say i've i've observed that it's incredibly hard to sustain confidence through all of these and as you can see they're things that we label bad loss what made that loss bad you made that loss bad in your mind. You called it bad, okay? And so we take all this stuff in our past and we make an assumption that we're gonna experience the same exact thing in the future. And in that assumption, we're putting our attention into the future and we're moving in that direction and we're actually inadvertently manifesting that. When you truly understand that this moment is the transformative moment and when you're experiencing massive insecurity and decide to show up anyways, when you lost 10 points in a row and and make the decision to actually let go of that and show up to this moment this new and see it new and not drag those those 10 lost points with you into this point and be like oh I don't I don't lose an 11th point when you actually make that decision to let that go and see the newness of this moment and show up to it and give this point a fresh take you're actually changing the trajectory of your future you're changing the trajectory of your future with the decision that you're making now. And this is why we don't want to plan the future because as you plan the future, you're actually manifesting it. You're actually creating that reality and contributing to that occurring over and over again, which is really, that's the main reason that we repeat patterns over and over and over again. We look at the past and we're saying, I don't want that to happen again. And that's the exact thing that like puts that as a, as a pathway in front of you. And it's the classic, whatever you fear, you actually begin to manifest. Well, why? Because you're, you're empowering and energizing that fear with your attention and you're hoping that it won't happen and you're, you're trying to make it not happen. And in your attempt to try to make it not happen, you're energizing that exact thing that you're afraid will happen. What we want to do in, and what we're trying to accomplish in the portal and what the whole entire first half of the cycle does as we become present as we reclaim our attention, as we're more comfortable to be ourselves, we are making authentic decisions and choices in the moment to show up. And as we do that, we're changing the trajectory and we're no longer struggling with the same stuff that we were struggling with before. But it requires that you actually let go of what you think your problem is and understand that that choice to let that go and show up to this moment is the way that we transform how we're being. And as you're being different, you'd have to agree that you're going to act differently and think differently and make different decisions. And as you do that, you're not going to struggle with the same stuff anymore because you're being different. And the way that you're be different is by take your attention off of what it's hung up on and direct it into the present moment. And you show up and you see it as brand new because you know what? It is. It is brand new. Boom. All right. That was really good stuff, man. Do you guys want us to keep on going? So, I don't know, that was the four confidence questions. Okay, cool. We, we got four composure questions. We're like 30 minutes in. I don't know if you want to call it. Well, a, we are. We, we didn't do a call the first two weeks, so I might as well rip it. All right, we're going to go. We're going to go a little bit longer if you guys want. Um, and if you guys have questions at this Spurs, drop them in. We'll prioritize that. Next question. <laughs> 